The world is covered by water, by 75%. In open water swimming, most like to participate, to stand on the shore and feel the frigid temperature, to feel the personal satisfaction of finishing the race. And then there are others who want to fight, to prove who is the best. Open water swimming, the fastest growing sport on earth, attracting thousands to the San Francisco Bay. National champions, world champions, and Olympians all racing for a $10,000 prize. Sponsored by Finis, the world leader in technical swimming products. This is the RCP Tiburon Mile. There's something about when your toes first touch the edge of the water, that brisk 62 degrees, this is where it gets real. The intensity of this race is really starting to mount. These athletes, when they first dive into the water, it sucks the breath out of you. Rounding out of Angel Island Cove and into the expanse of the San Francisco Bay, athletes are taking two different courses. We're about a quarter of the way through the race and we have a significant split in the field. The majority of the pack looks like they're on a nice line from Angel Island to Tiburon, but one of the former RCP champions is leading a pack which seems like out to the Golden Gate Bridge it looks extremely unadvantageous considering the tide is heading towards the Golden Gate Bridge, which would mean they'd have to turn around and go back against the tide back to Tiburon. So we'll see how it works out. There are your leaders, Kane Radford, Ryan Napoleon, and the Aussie, Cody Grimsey. But way out there in the distance is his brother, Trent Grimsey, the 2008 champion, leading the Russian star Vladimir Diachin out to sea and out of the money hunt. Kind of makes you wonder if the Grimsey brothers didn't plan this strategy ahead of time. Right in front of us, Vinny Donnelly has taken an aggressive and risky line, but it looks like it might pay off. The swimmers on the top are gonna to have to swim a longer distance, so we're gonna pay attention to see how this goes. Although he has not been drafting, his energy has to be waning. Vinny, 20 years old out of Tampa, Florida. You know him, Brooke. What's this gutsy move about? I've watched a number of his races. He's never afraid to make his own course. A bold choice, but not enough. He's about 10 seconds off our leaders, now entering the Tiburon Harbor. That's Kane Radford with Cody Grimsey right on his hip. Both men fighting for a $10,000 prize. Presented by Finise, producer of The Swim Sense. This is the RCP Tiburon Mile. <laughs> 